Hi, my name is Liberty McBride, and I'm the product manager for Admin Experience. Today, we wanted to share some updates about Audit Trail Reporting. We released Audit Trail Reporting in our API in December, and now we're pleased to announce that we have a new UI that will make it available to a greater number of users and simplify the process of conducting audits within PagerDuty. Organizations will get greater visibility into their configurations because we know that you need an easy way to operate and administer your critical software applications, including visibility into how those configs have been changed, when, and by whom. The new UI is available beginning January 28th. PagerDuty customers can now get audit reports for users, teams, schedules, escalation policies, and services. You can access audit records for the previous year on demand and at any frequency to comply with your organizational policy. New audit trail reporting delivers operational visibility and compliance to aid in understanding what change led to a missed incident. You'll be able to examine configuration history and determine what's going on at a larger scale, ensuring that you achieve compliance. If your account is on the business or digital operations plan, you can access audit trail reporting by clicking the view audit trail reporting button on any of the resources I mentioned previously. So be sure to be on the lookout for that new button um, and happy auditing. Now I'm gonna go ahead and show you a quick demo of how our audit trail reporting appears in the UI. For this demo, I'm going to go ahead and create a new user, and then I will show you what the audit trail records look like. So we'll go ahead and add the new user. I'll send out the invitation. All right, so the new user has been invited and let me go ahead and search for them. Here's Tommy. And here's that awesome view audit trail reporting button that I was talking about previously. So I'm going to go ahead and click this. And you can see here that in the past week there was one record change it says that I created Tommy Pickles as a limited user. Um, there's his email, time zone, his color. I also added on an email contact method for Tommy because I entered his email. Um, so that is listed here as well. And when I added that email, there's also an assignment notification rule added for that email address. So both low and high urgency. Here's the high one. Now if I go back to Tommy's account and I change something about him, like maybe I take off a low urgency notification rule and perhaps I also want to change something about his title. When I view audit reporting again, I now see three entries. One shows that I deleted an assignment notification rule. The other record shows that I added a job title for Tommy. So that's just a brief example of how our audit trail reporting works within PagerDuty. As mentioned, this is available for users, teams, escalation policies, schedules, and services. So feel free to check it out today in your account, and we'd love to hear your feedback. Thanks so much.